In today's video, I'm going to show you how to group your rows and columns here in Google Sheets Mobile. So you're working on a spreadsheet using your mobile phone, and you want to group some rows and columns. Here's how to do it. So let's start with our rows. Let's go ahead and zoom in. What I want to do is to group the applicants with names that start with the letter A. I'm going to do that by selecting those rows by tapping on this number right here on the left. So that's row number two, and I want to select until row number four with Amelia. So let's go ahead and select that by dragging this dotted line right here to select those rows. And there you have it. Now to group them, all you have to do is to tap in between those rows that are selected. Then you have your options right here. We have more options with this three dotted line right here on the right. And if you tap on it and swipe up, you'll see group two to four at the bottom. If you select it, there you have it. We've successfully grouped those three rows. Now at the moment they are expanded, but if we collapse that, all we have to do is to tap on this minus sign right here. We've hidden those three rows that were grouped together. Now, if we want to show them again, all we have to do is to expand by tapping on this plus sign right here. And there you have it. So let's collapse that again and move on to our columns. So let's say we want to group together columns B and C. Again, we're just going to select them by tapping on the letters at the very top and select column B and C by just moving again this dotted line right here up to the column that we want to select. There we have it. We're going to do the same thing. Tap at the top, hold on to that tap, and we have our same selection. Go to the three dotted line on the right and swipe up until the bottom where you'll see group columns B and C. If you tap on it, you'll have that indication at the top that B and C are grouped together and right now they're expanded. If we collapse by tapping on that minus sign, there you have it. We've successfully hidden those two columns that we've grouped together. Now to expand them again, we're going to do the same thing. Just tap on the plus sign and there you go. Let's do the same with our rows. There we have it. So you'll know that you have some group columns by just this indications at the top and at the left that would tell you that these rows are grouped together. So that's how to group rows and columns using your Google Sheets mobile app. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, do leave a like and subscribe for more helpful videos. See you on the next one.